Let's face it, this day and age, there's no such thing as being too cautious or too proactive when it comes to on-campus safety. But that won't stop the Faculty Senate Executive Committee from trying here at the University of Rhode Island. That's why on Thursday night, they assembled a panel of experts from the mental health field, nonviolent solutions field, and emergency preparedness to get a discussion going. The primary emphasis of the discussion were different uh, ways in which we can support students, staff, and faculty in managing difficult situations that uh, may be a precursor to um, psychological distress or, or even violent behaviors. The public and students were invited to this safety discussion on campus at URI. And although some people did address the topic of potentially arming campus police officers with guns, that was not the focus of the forum. There's the money issue, and of course I'm also concerned about the uh, resorting to arming when the incident last year was a non-incident, and uh, there's very little call for arming uh, our campus police. This discussion centered mainly on finding ways to identify potential issues before they become permanent life-changing problems or even violent on-campus situations. The University of Rhode Island is shifting the conversation and dialogue away from guns or no guns to how do we build the conditions in a university campus that's peaceful, that's safe, and makes students secure, rather than just focusing on whether police on the campus have guns or not. From here, each of the panelists will bring the suggestions made by the public back to their respective groups and organizations. The goal in the end is to make this campus overall a safer place to be. Here in South Kingstown, Julie Tremel, NBC 10 News, The Night Team.